and completions to Lockett, Coleman, Lockett, then to running. Then the pass interference call, and now a TD pass to Brad's side. Gives K-State a 20 to 17 lead. K-State's heart-stopping comeback improved the Wildcats to 4-2-1 and one in the Big 8 Conference and earned them their highest finish in the league since 1970. Following the regular season, K-State was flooded with postseason awards at both the conference and national level. Head coach Bill Snyder earned Big 8 Coach of the Year honors for the third time in four years and joined the legendary Bob Devaney as the only men in Big 8 Conference history to accomplish that feat. Snyder was also mentioned for almost every National Coach of the Year award and was one of four finalists for the prestigious Bear Bryant Football Writers Coach of the Year award and the Kodak Football Coaches Association Award. Six different Wildcats earned some type of All-American honor, including first-team free safety Jamie Mendez, second-team cornerback Thomas Randolph, and third-team receiver returner Andre Coleman on the widely recognized Associated Press All-America team. A total of 17 Wildcats earned all Big 8 recognition, which was the second-highest total in the league, while five of those players garnered first-team All-Big 8 status. If three-fourths of the earth is covered by water, then in 1993, the rest was covered by consensus All-American free safety, Jamie Mendez. A punishing tackler with a nose for the ball and a knack for the big play, Mendez became just the second player in K-State history to earn consensus All-American honors as he was named first team by AP, Kodak, Football News, and the NFL Draft Report. Mendez also earned first-team All-Big 8 honors for the third consecutive year to become just the sixth player in Kansas State history to achieve that feat. Jamie Mendez finished his career as the Wildcats' all-time interception leader and tied for eighth in the all-time Big 8 list with 15. At the start of the season, many publications called Thomas Randolph the most underrated player in the Big 8 conference. By season's end, they were calling him one of the best cornerbacks in college football. Rated as the top defensive back in the nation by the NFL Draft Report, Randolph earned second-team All-America honors from Associated Press and was a consensus first-team All-Big 8 selection. Randolph finished second in the Big 8 with four interceptions and had a hand in 10 of K-State's 23 takeaways with three fumbles caused and three fumbles recovered. Johnny Rogers at Nebraska and Barry Sanders at Oklahoma State both won Heisman Trophy. But the title of the Big 8's best all-purpose back of all time bears the name of Kansas State's Mr. Excitement, Andre Coleman. In 1993, Coleman became the first player in Big 8 history to lead the league in all-purpose yards, kickoff returns, and punt returns. Coleman earned third-team All-American honors from AP and was the only player in the country to rank among the top 15 players in all-purpose yards, kickoff returns, and punt returns. He finished fifth in the nation in punt returns and fourth in the nation in kickoff returns and added a K-State career record 12 touchdown receptions. Although offensive linemen rarely stand in the spotlight, K-State center Quentin New Year will be remembered as one of the top centers in Big 8 history. New Year started a Kansas State record 45 games and played virtually every offensive snap since the first game of his freshman season. As a senior, he was a unanimous choice as the first team all Big 8 center on all 16 ballots distributed by the Associated Press, and he earned third-team All-America honors from the NFL Draft Report. If the Big 8 gave out a Most Valuable Player Award based on impact and what that person's play meant to the success of their team, Chad May probably would have been the hands-down winner. Chad May turned the Big 8 Conference on its ear in 1993 by setting four league passing records and threw for the third most yards in Big 8 history with a total of 2,000 682 yards. That figure was the most ever by a junior quarterback in Big 8 history and broke the Kansas State single season record held by Hall of Famer Lynn Dickey. May was a runaway choice as the league's newcomer of the year and was named first team all conference by the coaches and honorable mention all American by the UPI. Kenny McIntyre is a success story in the making. An unheralded cornerback at the start of the season McIntyre turned in a brilliant senior campaign to earn honorable mention All-American honors from the NFL Draft Report. That publication also called him the best athlete in the Big 8 and the most underrated player in the nation. 
But that all changed on national television at the Copper Bowl when he turned in a dominating performance against Wyoming All-American Ryan Yarborough to earn Defensive Player of the Game honors. 